Now, as a blurred, I'm all about people of color being included in the superhero world. So I was happy to read a story on Salon.com about a Sikh man in New York City who spent the day walking around New York dressed as Captain America. So we sent our own Hari Kondabalu to the streets to see if New Yorkers were ready to meet the new Captain America. Check it out. Hari Kondabalu, Man About Town. I was amazed to read a Salon magazine article about a Sikh man named Vishwajit Singh who dressed up as Captain America and walked around New York City. I thought it was really brave and kind of weird. So I had to meet him. Hey, man. <laughs> So why did you decide to do this? It started with an illustration I did for the New York Comic Con a couple of years ago. It's a picture with a little catchy caption basically saying, chill, it's just a turban, now let's kick some intolerant ass. A year later, Milwaukee happens. The massacre at a Sikh temple in Milwaukee. There I was in June, uh, walking the streets as Captain America. Why Captain America? It's the most patriotic of superheroes. Started in 1941, fighting the Axis powers. Now, Captain America comes back, fights hit crimes. Even the squirrel couldn't believe what he was seeing. <laughs> so how would the people of New York respond? Like these guys? What do you think when you think Captain America? What images come to mind? A bunch of bullshit that they made up for somebody, you know, to watch and sell costumes and stuff like that. Do you want to write for a TV show? <laughs> when you think Captain America, what do you usually imagine? Uh, more muscles. Yeah. Taller. Yeah. Wider. <laughs> right, right, right. Would you like to meet the first ever see Captain America? Oh, absolutely. Yes. Absolutely. How you doing? I'm wow. Captain, America. Captain America. Look at you. You are awesome. Thank you. Do you think America's ready for this kind of Captain America? No. <laughs> <laughs> they can't accept the half black president. Right, they don't right, right. see Captain America. Maybe people just needed to be more comfortable with turbans. So seat Captain America tied a few on. How long does this normally take for you to do in the morning? Three minutes. How long's your hair? Uh, waist length. Suck it, Superman. Uh-huh. Still not impressed? Perhaps you need to see the rest of his superpowers. Like opening transportation portals with his magic yellow card. <laughs> Using his enhanced supervision to pick out quality produce. Taxi! But his most amazing power? He can get a black man a cab. Enjoy. Wow. Wow, we, bud. Now, we all know Superman's weakness is kryptonite. But what about Seat Captain America? Where did you both grow up? Jersey. Will this fly in Jersey? Not where I live. My town is like 95% white. They vote conservative every single year. Jersey. Would you go to Jersey? I would. The right time and place, right crew. So you're saying right time and place, daylight, right people, <laughs> bodyguards. Yeah. Maybe. <laughs> yes. <laughs> But we soon discovered that New Jersey wasn't the only place where ignorance was found. What do you think of the new Captain America? Um, I think he's rather racist. An Arab dressed up as a Captain America. Well, he's actually not Arab. He's a, he's a, he's a Sikh man, a heritage from India. Right. Like, if he came as Superman or Spider-Man, you think it'd be any different? You think Superman... When you've seen an Arab Superman, I mean, you yeah. think it was pretty funny. But remember, though, he's not Arab. Damn it, Anthony Kiedis impersonator. Fortunately, Sikh Captain America sprung to action. This is how I see it. I was born here, right? I'm as American as somebody else, right? That's what I'm trying to do here, is just know, get people out of the little boxes. That's the genius of it. I guess people are just closed-minded, you know? Me, I find it hilarious. I mean, I live for things like this. This yeah. is hysterical. Yeah, I mean, that's, and that's good. Impressive. Patience as a superpower. I would have just stabbed him. <laughs> Now the most important mission of all, winning over the children. What do you think of the new look Captain America? He doesn't look like the real Captain America, like bulky and strong. What if I told you it was emotional strength? So he's gonna like talk to the super villains and so they don't do crimes like a therapist? <laughs> yeah, like a therapist. I think it works a lot for comedy. But you don't think it will work for action? I'm not that sure it's gonna work for action. It's like a real Captain America movie. You gotta work out a lot, a lot. Okay. You got a way better shield. Okay. Clean yourself up a little bit. Okay. Put on some shoes. <laughs> better costume. Um, Turban's fine. Yeah. Beard's fine. That's it. Yeah. Wow. They had no problem with his turban and beard. 
They just said what we were all thinking. He is the least intimidating superhero ever. Captain America, we here at Totally Biased really appreciate what you're doing, so we wanted to help you by providing you with some Totally Biased Avengers. Presenting Asian Thor. I am Thor, God of Thunder. Black Black Widow. Gay Hulk. Hulk gay. And my favorite superhero of all, Brown Jesus Christ, also known as Jesus Christ. New Jersey, here we come.